Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to show you how to change up the header colors and shadows on WordPress Bloxy. Okay, so here we have our website and we have our header over here. And it's a sticky header, as you can see. And there are some shadows here. Um, and it's kind of plain up top over here. So let's go ahead and click on Customize to take us to the WordPress Customizer. Alternatively, we can go to our dashboard and hover down over Appearance and click on Customize. That will take you to the WordPress Customizer. Okay, so again, we have just a plain one here and there's some shadow. Let's start by changing up the top row. So we just click on top row and we have our structure over here and our height and so on. But in this video, we're concerned about the color. So let's click on design. And you can see uh, the background is by default white. So let's make that red. Or, uh, yeah, let's, let's give it a, a reddish gradient. Okay. And sometimes it doesn't load up, but there it is. Right. And you can see on sticky state, it's white. So when we scroll down and then scroll back up, you can see it's white until we get to the very top. Okay. Alternatively, we can just have this white and our sticky state is going to be uh, the one with color. So here we have our um, header and when we scroll down and then reveal it, we can see that our header has some colors. So it really depends on what you want and you can see it disappears. So let's just make this red and then let's make this um, like a bluish gradient. And then you can see it's different until we scroll to the top. Let's make it a bit more apparent. And let's go ahead and change every single one of these to have a different color. So by default, we want this one to be cyan. And then in our sticky state, we want it to be dark brown, burgundy. And on the bottom row one, we can have it be a completely different gradient. And when it's sticky, we want it to have a beige color so you can see we have our colors over here when we scroll down and then reveal our sticky header it's completely different until we get to the top okay what else can we do with our design so again let's start with the top row design and then we can add borders here and we can change how this looks like and then we can have our colors and then the the border will change when we're on sticky mode. And you can see the borders are a bit different. And we can have full width on our border. And you can see by default, it's kind of scrunched up. Full width takes up the whole thing. And we can also have a bottom border. And we can thicken this up like seven pixels and make full width as well. And again, we can enable or disable um, these on mobile, tablet, and desktop. And then for shadow, we can add some shadow and enable it. And you can see we have some shadow going on. All right. And let's go ahead and change up the main row. And let's do the same. Let's add some shadow to it. Well, let's enable it first. And let's add some color. All right, green would probably be good. There you go. And on our sticky state, we want it to be red, right? And we want the spread and blur and the offset. And you can see that we have like some, some mad underglow happening over there, right? But um, if you do it too hard, it kind of covers up our menu and text over there. So we changed the colors, we changed the shadows, we, add, we added some borders. Let's go ahead and publish this and double check how it looks like on our website itself. Okay, so let's wait for that to load. We have our original one over here, which is all plain. Let's hit refresh. And now you can see our header has some pretty funky colors and some borders and shadows. And when we scroll down and scroll up to reveal, we have different colors now on our, and shadows as well, on our header. And when we scroll back up, they change back to their default state. So you've successfully changed your headers, colors, and shadows on WordPress Bloxy. So if you found this video helpful, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe to our channel as it really helps us out with the YouTube algorithm. 
show this kind of video to other nerds like us. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next one.